All right, filmmakers. Bold filmmakers. Most filmmakers, most independent filmmakers, are not bold enough to stand out. They refuse to be original for some reason, to exercise their creativity, which is something... I've... Okay. <laughs> Why is this? Why is there so much uh, snobism? I don't know. I can tell you that I have, I have witnessed a lot of opportunities for filmmakers to be... Okay, who am I? <laughs> I'm a sound mixer. I've been doing sound for independent films, not to be confused with uh, Hollywood big productions. I've been doing a lot of... Uh, I've been working in the independent film industry in New York City for 10 plus years and in general for 15 years. And I have seen in my uh, short career so many opportunities for filmmakers to be creative and to be crazy and to be just super original and they refuse to use those opportunities in favor of doing whatever is trending at the time. They want to be trendy. They want to be the next whatever name already exists. They don't want to be the first themselves. And that's a problem, I think, because the art uh, suffers. Of course, you, I, will, I could say um, arrogantly that that benefits those of us who actually don't, are not afraid of being original. But in reality, come on, the audiences tend to lean towards whatever is trending at the time. So I, I understand that they have a point. But um, I encourage those of you who are not afraid of exercising your creativity to do it. Be creative, be original, don't be afraid. Don't. I've seen movies cut short because the filmmakers were too afraid of... Uh, stuff that was crazy or that was crossing a certain line of um, a certain line of what's the word for the eccentricity okay i don't be eccentric why 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 are you not letting out all everything that is in you don't be afraid to be eccentric i understand if you're looking for client work if you're looking for to do commercials and stuff like that i understand that there are standards that you want to follow if you want to do commercial stuff, you do want to be trendy. But in the independent film industry, if you are doing films for yourself or for your festivals or for the, f the future or to, to make a statement about something or whatever, be creative. Don't, you don't have to follow uh, standards for that. In, in fact, I think those of us who do do those uh, films are responsible for just pushing the boundaries to whatever extremes of, of your creative brain, your creative man, mind can take you. Uh, so that's my message for today. It's, I suppose it's a message. Uh, well, anyways. Okay, this video is long enough. I'm already starting to talk in circles. I'll see you next time.